Gabriela. I want you to know that your mom and I love you. And you have been an incredible daughter to us. We are proud and glad to be your parents. Your mom and I have been having issues that seem irreconcilable. I know you must have seen us a couple of times, you know, having problems which is not good for you and your mental health. So, we have come to a conclusion to get a divorce. You should be more concerned about your daughter's recovery rather than creating more problems and arguing here. Please, can you excuse me while I examine her? No, he will leave while I wait and watch over my daughter. Who, who is your daughter? No, 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 no. Oh, while you watch over your daughter, are you okay? Oh, she's now your daughter. Yes. She is now your daughter. All those times you were traveling, you abandoned her. You go to Kabanta and Kaduna. No, 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 continue flying. No, Mr. Fly Bucci! Please, can you both listen to me? Please, can the two of you excuse me? Please, please excuse me. It isn't as you excuse us. Mr. Bucci and Madam, please, can the both of you excuse me? If not for the doctor, me and you will not live here today. It's better you come, let us go. So that you can attend to my daughter. Rubbish. No, your daughter. You are a very responsible She is now your daughter. You are very responsible Why are you flying around with your dog? I don't even know if you are sleeping with her. Don't worry, I'll find her out. But that's okay. Child. Doctor, what happened to my child? What happened to my child? What happened to her is called vasovagal syncope. Vasovagal syncope is a term used to describe when someone thinks because their body overreacted to certain behavior, such as extreme emotional distress. Now, the vasovagal syncope trigger caused her heart rate and blood pressure to drop suddenly. This reduced the flow of blood to her brain, thereby resulting to her suddenly losing consciousness. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. D Doctor, please. I don't want to lose my child. Please. Doctor, 
what do I do? Like I said, something triggered it. Probably a bad news or something. But whatever you told her that caused her to think, it should be avoided. If it's something you can change, please do change it. That is to avoid the occurrence. Was school today? School was very fine. Mom, Mr. Lizzie was so proud of me for coming first in the quiz today. Wow, that's and lovely. The whole class clapped for me, which is so touching. <laughs> wow, my daughter is a genius. Yes, I am. <laughs> and tomorrow we'll be having a spelling day, and mm. I also plan to come first in it. I am very sure you will. I so, will, Mom. So your dad and I can take you to Fun Planet for your birthday. Really? <laughs> yes, baby. Oh my God, Mom! Thank you. I love you so much. I love you too. What you need to do for me is concentrate on your studies so that you can come out in flying colors. I will, Mom. <laughs> I love you, baby. I love you too. Oh, oh my God, the roots are so bad. Oh. Easy. Okay, take it easy then. Yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> I made it as a reward for coming first in your school quiz. <laughs> Mom, thank you so much. I love you. I love you too. Um, you know, let's go and eat, then do your assignment before Henry Danger starts on Nicolegio. <laughs> oh my God, I can't wait to watch today's episode. I know. Like yesterday's episode, it was so funny. <laughs>
welcome, Daddy. How are you doing, my angel? Welcome back. Yes. Yes. I came first in the school fish today. Whoa, you did? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. you. Yes, I have. And she made me into this as a reward. You like it? I, I love it. That's so cool. That's why I will challenge myself to come first in my forthcoming examination so that you and mom can take me to Foam Planet. I love that. I love that. Challenging yourself. That's a good one. It's all right. Congratulations. So, I promise you, if you pass all your exams, we are not only going to take you to Palm Planet. I will buy you an iPad. Really? Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dad. I promise you, I will study harder. I can keep for that, okay? Okay. Be careful. All right. All right? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Honey, how are you? I'm fine. Mm -hmm. So, how was work today? Work was fine. And um, were you able to meet up with your clients from Canada? Oh, yes. And they like my proposal. That's <laughs> wonderful. That means you are getting the contract. Ah, hopefully, hopefully, I believe God I'm going to get it. <laughs> okay, so let me fix you something to do. <laughs> yeah. Mm. My heavy duty. Please be fast. In my mathematics. Wow, smart girl. <laughs> no, not today. You shouldn't be watching TV. You need to be preparing for your forthcoming exam. Okay, mom. Um, you know what? Just go upstairs, take a shower while I prepare lunch, okay? Okay, mom, I love you. I love you too. Thank you, mom. For what? For being the best mom in the world. Oh, yeah, thank you, darling. Thank you. When you see your dad, hug him for being the best dad in the world. I will surely do that. Do and that. don't forget to hug him. Um, yeah, yeah, I will. Now go take a shower so we can do your assignment together. Okay. Hi, angels. I. Oh. Did your voice? Gabriela is asleep. Oh, sorry. I didn't know she's. Okay, let me take her. 
not in there. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, baby girl. Easy, easy, right? Oh, come on. You're supposed to be chilling in your room. Okay. Oh. So what's up, darling? How was your day? Boring. Boy, what's fine? Oh, um, guess what? What? I got a contract. <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. With this contract, I have surpassed my target for the quarter, so I'm good to go. <laughs> Um, what's wrong? Are you not happy for me? Of course I am happy for you. But this is not about you. It is about me. Oh. What happened? Are you alright? Talk to me. Gucci, all I do in this house when I wake up is clean. Cook, take Gabriella to school, pick her up from school. It's it's becoming boring. I am tired. Is there anything wrong with that? There's so many things wrong with it. It's 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 boring. I am bored, and the boredom is beginning to get me depressed. When I graduated from the university. I had dreams of working and making an impact in the oil and gas sector. But you didn't allow me to follow my dreams. Olivia, why are you talking like this? Have I not been taking good care of you and our daughter? Was there any time you asked me for something and I say I don't have? It is not about that, Bucci. It is about me pursuing my dreams. Just as I have envisaged. Olivia. You have been doing well. You have been making an impact in the home sector. You've been doing great. I am not complaining. Right? Okay, um, what if I increase your monthly allowance? It's not about monthly allowance. This is about pursuing my dreams. When we first got married, you said I should wait until Gabriela is old enough before I can start working. She's 10, Bucci. 10. Is she not old enough? She's old enough. But I don't want you to walk. Why? Olivia, I want your undivided attention in this family. I want no distractions. Oh, you, I... There is no but. There is no but. I have spoken and that's final.
What's wrong, baby? You didn't even touch your food. Nothing. I don't have an appetite. <laughs> Come on, baby. <laughs> we all know you're a foodie. I mean, talk to me. What's going on? I am bored, Buchi. I am bored. My life is like a boring routine. I do the same thing over and over again. I don't do anything challenging or exciting with my life. I am beginning to fall into depression. And it's looking like my life is stagnant. Hey, come on, baby. I mean, you are not stagnant, all right? Your success is visible in the life of our daughter. Look at you, molding her into a young, beautiful and virtuous lady. I know. I know, but I need to forge a path for myself. Not me waking up when I'm 60, realizing I helped other people achieve their dreams without achieving mine. I don't even know whether to accept or not. I'm just confused. Um, baby, you don't need to be confused. My love, just accept. Even if I accept, how do you get a job in the oil and gas sector? You know that's not my sector and obviously I have no connection there. Um, Baby, that's not a problem. There is this female friend of mine who works in an oil and gas firm. Um, I talked to her and, in fact, I already submitted my CV. So hopefully I get the job. Just like that? No time, baby. Mm. All right. Um, I wish you the best in your proposed career journey, right? Good luck. Thank you. Good luck, baby. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I love you. I love you too. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> On the road, don't know how to drive. Baby, are you okay? I'm, I'm fine. You know, I'm so sorry for coming to pick you late. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I'll just stop by now and buy you ice cream. Okay, I don't want ice cream. Are you sure? I'm going to buy you your favorite uh, flavor vanilla with coconut toppings. But you keep me waiting for more than two hours. Oh. Sorry, sorry. You oh. were saying you keep me waiting for more than two hours. Baby, I know it's not my fault. I was so busy at work and I needed to hasten up so that my boss won't get angry. You're always busy at work. Since you started work. Sorry, I'll drive carefully. I'll drive carefully. Mom, since you started working, you, you now come late to pick me up from school. Baby, I'm sorry. Eh? There is this uh, uh, training that is happening in France. So I am working extremely hard so that my boss can recommend me. You know, if I get to France and I'm coming back, I'll buy you something. Oh. 
Hey, my so dear. You want to leave me, right? No, baby. It's just for a month or two. A month or two? My darling, it might even... You've never left me for one day. Not to talk of a month. My darling, it might even be more. Oh, come on, it's work and it's it's important I go. Eh, my love. Don't worry, your daddy will take care of you, okay? Don't worry. Eh? Eh, you know what? Let's let's just stop by and I'll get you pizza with the ice cream. Eh? I'll Baby. Miss you more. I'll miss you too. I know I love you, okay? I'm doing all this because of you. Eh, my love. Okay? Smile for mommy now. I'll buy you pizza. Baby, don't cry. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Sorry, my child. Sorry. I'll buy you pizza with the ice cream. Hmm? Mm -hmm. You are smile for mommy. <laughs> Gabriela, smile for mommy. Mm -hmm. Smile. <laughs> smile for mommy. Who you watch? Oh, yeah. Sorry, I'm watching. Oh, I just need to. These people should leave the road. Calm down. I will. I'm calm. I'm calm. It's, it's traffic light. Yes, I have to beat the traffic light. Get out of the road. Oh my god. Don't close the door. Mom, yeah? why are you running like you're training for the Olympics? Um, I want to quickly fix dinner before your dad gets back. Well, if you had returned earlier, you wouldn't be rushing to make dinner. Uh -uh. <sighs> Help me. Uh, please. Um, not today, Gabriela. I am very busy. But that's what you always say. You're always busy. You stopped helping me with my assignment since you started working. You know what? I am going to get you a very good tutor, okay? I don't need a tutor, Mom. I want you to assist me. Young woman, watch your tone. Wait, why must I even help you with your assignment? Did your teacher not explain to you before giving it to you? See, I am very busy. I have a proposal to submit tomorrow morning. Oh. Babe, <clears throat> um, I've been recommended for a training in France and by the grace of God, I might be selected for the training. You want to travel to France and leave Gabriela and I for who? 
<laughs> come on, baby. I haven't even been selected yet. And besides, I am gone for just one or two months. One or two months? One or two months. How are we going to cope? See, baby. You will certainly cope. You know what? I will just get a domestic staff to help around the house. Will you stop that? You know a domestic staff is not an option for me. You know how I don't want a caregiver around me. That is why I refused you working for all these years. Come on, baby. This is my dream we are talking about here. Besides, it's not like I used to complain each time you travel. Have I been outside of this house for a week? You're talking about a month or two. See, let me tell you. It's not as long as you're making it seem like. Oh, Before you open your eyes and close it, I'll be back. You won't even feel my absence at all. Eh? Baby. What's all, this? What's all this now? What's all this? Eh? What is this? What is all what? Buchi? Olivia, I need to talk to you. I need to talk to you. What is it you want to talk to me about that I cannot wait till morning? I should wait till morning when I'm angry? Is it what you're saying? Who offended you? Why are you? You angry? did! You did, Olivia! When was the last time you made love to me? No, I ask you! Buchi, how am I supposed to keep tabs of the last time we made love? You can't even remember because it has been long! Yes! It has been long! But Olivia! I am a man with blood running through my veins! I need to touch you! I need you to touch me! I need to make love! Eh? A hungry man is an angry man! And you know what I need? I need to do! I need to touch you! I need to make love! What nonsense! Luchi, as you can see, I am very tired. I have a proposal to submit at the office tomorrow. I need to sleep. <laughs> eh? Olivia, Olivia, don't be heartless. Don't be heartless. Have pity on me. Olivia, have pity on your husband. Just make love to me. Make love to me. Let me be fine. It's all about work, work, work. Is that what you want? Yes. That is what you want? Yes. Oh, yeah. Come and do. Would you come and do? Is it not wide enough? Oh yeah, I have not put it anyway. But you come and do. Come and do. But you come and do now. Take it down. Take it down. Take it down. But you have to take it and do. Take it down. Is that how you give it to your husband? Is that how to make love to your husband? How else do you want me to give it to as you? As you come and take it from the back, it's open. Oh. Open kill you. Oh my God. Yeah. Open kill you. Well, this is more than a lottery. Guess what? I just got an email that I have been selected for the training. It's us! I am so happy! <laughs> so you're excited you're leaving us? Don't talk like that, Buchi. You know I have worked so hard for this. You know how many people from different parts of the world would be in that training. You're supposed to be happy for me instead of guilt stripping me. I don't even know if I'm happy or sad. But I am happy you're making strides in your career. And I am sad you're leaving us. Happy 
to be, but I'm, I'm just going to be gone for a while. So how do we cook? How do we eat? That is not a problem. I am going to make different types of soup that will last for a week. Then I'll try and get you a cook. You know you're the only one that cooks the one I like. I know, baby. You just have to manage. It's just for a month. But, mom, who will pick me up from school and help me with my assignment? Gabriela, your daddy will pick you up from school. And then I'll try to get you a home tutor that will help your assignment. Okay? When I accepted, you should walk. I never begin for this. Baby, do you know it's paramount I go for this training? This training will increase my profile in my office. I just be patient for a little while, okay? Baby. 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 Yes, darling. You were late again. Ah, oh, I'm so sorry, baby girl, okay? I was in a board meeting. I had to run out to come pick you up. I understand. It's okay. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, darling. You know, it hasn't been easy for dad since your mother traveled. I've been trying to manage both home and work activities, you know, multitasking and all. It hasn't been easy for me. So please bear with daddy, okay? I know, dad. I know you're trying your best. I just can't wait for mom to come home. Me too. Me too. But hopefully she's coming back soon, okay? Okay, dad. So cheer up. All right? So how was school today? Very fine. Good. <laughs> My baby girl. Don't worry, when we get home, I'll just make you noodles and egg with tomatoes, right? Okay, dad. I know it's your favorite. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. You love it. Really? Yeah. Oh. You love it. I used to go to me stockfish and dry fish to make it. Wow. Enjoy your meal. I'm coming. Okay. God bless this food in Jesus' name. Amen.
How are you? No, I really miss you. Yeah, I miss you too. I miss you too. How have you been? I'm very fine. Um, <laughs> you know what? I got something for you from France. Really? Yes. Where is it? It's in my bag. Once I unpack, I'll give it to you. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're but, welcome. Do you know that's not my birthday gift, right? Of course I know. Your trip to the fun planet still stands. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> sure, my love. Hi, my love. How are you? You're welcome. <laughs> okay, so just take that upstairs, okay? okay? Careful, careful. So, baby, come, let me just do. Oh. Sit down. I miss you so much. Ah, I missed you too. How are you? I'm good. How was so, your training? My training was perfect. I met different type of people from different parts of the world. You know, it made me realize that I still have a long way to go in this career. <laughs> oh. Yes. No, you still have a long way to go. Yes. Yeah. You know what? I can't even wait to start working officially. <laughs> I'm so happy. <sighs> Baby, I miss you so much. <laughs> mm, so good to be home. <sighs> oh. So, baby girl, I hope you enjoyed your day. Yes, I did. Thank you, mom. Thank you, dad. Can we go there again next weekend? Oh, yes, we can. Uh, um, <laughs> I hope it is not what I'm thinking. <clears throat> baby, I need to attend a forum in Canada. It's a privilege for me to be selected. And I can't risk it. Mom, you just came back last week. And you want to travel again? Okay. I know. But it's important that I attend this forum. I will be going with my CEO and that is a big deal. Baby, I will get to meet the people that cause the shots in the oil and gas sector. And this forum will really boost my career. So you will miss my birthday, right? No, I won't miss your birthday for anything in the world. Of course I will be in your birthday. Honestly, I am not happy with all this traveling spree. Believe me, I am not happy with all this traveling spree. What's all this? You just came back and you're talking about traveling again. You barely spend time with us. What's all this? Yeah, I know. I know. But this is my career we are talking about here. And I'll be back before you know it. So you're trying to tell us that your job is more important than us, right? Baby, I'm not saying that. My family is important and my job is important too. Hey, please, baby, don't, don't, don't get angry. Please, leave me. Honestly, I'm not happy. Leave me, please. Baby, don't be like that now. <sighs> baby. Don't baby me. Baby. Baby now. Baby. Don't baby me, please. Baby, we need your please. time. We, we need your attention. We need your time. But I'm here now. I'm going in just a few days. Baby. She's supposed to come back next week. But next week is my birthday. Will she be around for my birthday? Hopefully she will be around. She promised to be here, right? I so... know she promised, but she's always busy. I'm scared something might come up and she might miss it. You don't have to be scared, okay? I believe she will be here for your birthday. But let me call her so you confirm. Right?
hello. How are you doing, baby? Oh, well, well, we are here. We are good. I'm good, but uh, Gabriella isn't. Um, she's scared. She's scared you won't be back for her birthday. So I said, let me call you so you assure her that yourself. She's listening. We're here together. Hello, mom. Are you sure? Really? Okay, mom. I love you. Okay, mom. I can't wait. I love you too, mom. Bye. All right, darling. Please make sure you come back for her birthday, all right? Have a wonderful day. Love you too. <laughs> so, happiness? Why not? Good, you've confirmed yourself, eh? Yes, I have, but I can't wait for my birthday. I'll be the happiest girl in the world. Mm, it's fine. <laughs> what are you watching? Just... she returned. But she sent me a message. She said she was in an important meeting that when she's done, she called. Hasn't the meeting ended? I don't know. But she said she wouldn't miss it for anything in the world. Come on, Angel. Come on, my baby girl, don't cry, okay? It's your day, remember? And daddy is here to make sure you enjoy your day. Right? But my day is not complete without mom. Today was supposed to be a happy day for me, but mom ruined it all. Hey, come on. I know mom would wish to be here. Okay? But I'm sure something came up. Something always comes up. Are you sure mom still loves me? Hey, baby girl, don't talk like that, okay? We will always love you and nothing can ever change that. All right? Come on, stop crying. Okay? Stop crying, baby girl. Daddy loves you. And daddy is here to take you to phone planets, buy you anything you want, make sure my baby is happy. Okay? So put a smile on this beautiful face. All right? Come on, smile for daddy. Smile, that's good. I'm going to get you pizza, you know, shawarma, cup ice cream, cupcakes, all right? Just to make you happy. And um, daddy got you a little thing for the start, okay? And this is it. So come on, cheer up for daddy, okay? Okay. Yeah. So different, can you feel us pulling apart? Everything is changing, and my heart is failing. I can't seem to understand what is really going on.
Hume I'm home. Won't you greet your mommy? Mom look. You won't hug your mommy? Sorry I missed your birthday. It wasn't intentional. I had to extend my stay because I had some prospective clients to, to attend to. But you promised you wouldn't miss it. I know I did. But the meetings were so important and I couldn't leave my boss behind. You couldn't even call to wish me a happy birthday. Even when dad called, why didn't you pick? Baby, I said I was in a meeting. I couldn't have missed your call deliberately. The meeting was so important and my boss asked me to stay back. So a meeting is now more important than my birthday, right? No, 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 baby, I didn't say that. I am sorry. My boss asked me to wait and I I had no choice than to wait. I'm sorry. So you stayed back because your boss asked you to. But you missed my birthday even after you promised you, you wouldn't. Baby, I'm sorry. That's, that's the, it's just that. Mom, so you stayed back because your boss asked you to. <laughs> Baby, that, that's that's the thing is I I you uh, that that's not. <laughs> mm. You've changed. G G Gabriela, Gabriela, it's not like, it's not it's not what you think, uh, Gabriela. G hey. You're back. Yeah. You didn't even tell me you were coming in. I would have come to the airport to pick you up. Um, actually, I, I didn't want to disturb you. Besides, I thought you wouldn't. Maybe you might be angry too. Yes, I'm angry with you. But, but I'm sorry. I, I didn't miss her birthday deliberately. You shouldn't be apologizing to me. She's the one you offended. I, I'll talk to her later when she's relaxed. You better do. Baby. You better talk to her. She misses her mom. I know, babe. But I am at a critical stage of my career right now. And I'm at the verge of getting something big. Huh. My dear wife, your family is at a critical stage now. And you are the verge of losing something bigger. I can see you drifting. Can, see you drifting. can you hear me calling? Girl, it feels so different. so different. Can you feel us pulling apart? Yeah. Everything, is changing. Everything is changing. And my heart is racing. I can seem to understand what is really going on. Cause you're never always there, and it's driving me insane. Tell me, do you really care? Girl, I'm getting really scared. Cause you're never always there, and it's driving me insane. Tell me, do you really care? Whoa. Mm -hmm. So, have you reconciled with uh, Gabriela? Of course, yes. Remember, we are buddies, and buddies don't fight for long. I bribed her with pizza and ice cream. Hey, that's bribery and corruption. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> uh -huh. You and work. Yeah. Can you just have little time for your husband? Um, uh, oh, uh, no. Buchi, Buchi, please. Not today. As you can see, I am very busy. 
<sighs> Come on, baby. Uh, uh, just, just give me at least 15 minutes of your time. Look at you looking all sexy. And... Baby, 15 oh. minutes is too much of my time. I have a proposal to submit at work tomorrow. Uh, you, to, you can see, obviously, I'm busy. Olivia, mm? are you married to your job? Um, what does that mean? I'm asking you. Um, Bucci, I seriously do not have time for your tantrums this night. Yeah. Olivia, so me complaining that you're denying me of sex is now tantrums, right? Huh? Bucci, I am not denying you of sex. I am obviously busy. As you can see. What's even wrong with you? No, tell me, what's wrong with you? Every time, walk, walk, walk. You can't give your husband little time. I need sex. Yes, I need it. Give me a little of your time. A little of your time. Please. Every time, walk, walk, walk. Who does that? And where are you going to? Where I won't throw tantrums. And where I won't be disturbing you. You can do your work. Whatever. Like someone is trying to drink away his paint. But when the alcohol clears, the problem remains. At least I drink away my pains for the moment. Yes. You have to slow down. Or is the problem that serious? Huh. You won't understand. You won't. Yes. Then make me understand. <laughs> you never can tell I might have a solution to your problem. You can never have solution to my problem. My wife is. Oh, that. I sensed it was a wife-related issue. You think so? I know so. Huh? I mean, which man comes to the bar in pajamas? I rushed out of the house. Obviously, you rushed out. Perhaps you stormed out of the house. Yes, I did. So tell me, was your wife screaming and nagging the hell out of you? Oh, if she was doing that, I mean, I, I, I can manage that. Oh, yes. I really? Can. What could be worse than that? No. No, tell me, tell me. What woman denies her husband sex and time because of her so-called beloved job? Tell me. I have told her countless time. Great time for your husband and your family, but she wouldn't listen. The more I complain, the busier she gets. I am tired. I am confused. I am angry. Thank you. Well, I think it would be very nice of me to take you to a place where you will have a taste of candy.
or what the hell is the candy? Where could I be? Come in. Oh yeah. Wow. Nice. Welcome to my humble apartment. Oh, I see. Thank you so much. Okay. It's beautiful. Um, it's ah, oh, it's nice. Make yourself comfortable, all right? I'll join you. Okay. Soon. Okay. Yeah. I'll be right back. It's all right. Okay, Mr. Bucci. Tell me. Oh, yeah. So I'm here. Up? I'm here. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. What can I offer you? Oh. What can I get oh. for you? I mean, you talked about... Oh, oh. You talked about candy. How can I get this candy? Of course, I will not tell you, but I can show you. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. But... The question is... Are you sure you want to have a taste of this candy? Are you sure about uh, that? Oh, yeah. Uh, uh -huh. um. Guess what? I just got an email that I have been selected for the training. It's us! I am so happy! <laughs> so you're excited you're leaving us? Don't talk like that, Pucci. You know I have worked so hard for this. You know how many people from different parts of the world would be in that training. You're supposed to be happy for me instead of guilt stripping me. I don't even know if I'm happy or sad. But I am happy you're making strides in your career. And I am sad you're leaving us. Baby, but I'm, I'm just going to be gone for a while. So how do we cook? How do we eat? That is not a problem. I am going to make different types of soup that will last for a week. Then I'll try and get you a cook. You know you're the only one that cooks the one I like. I know, baby. You just have to manage. It's just for a month. But, mom. Pick me up from school and help me with my assignment. Gabriela, your daddy will pick you up from school and then I'll try to get you a home tutor that will help your assignment. Okay? When I accepted, you should walk. I never begin for this. Baby, do you know it's paramount I go for this training? This training will increase my profile in my office. And just be patient for a little while. Okay? Baby. 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 You brought happiness back to my life. You filled the void my wife created. Why wouldn't I do anything to make you happy in return? Name whatever it is, and it will be done. That sounds so much like an assurance. That is what it is. 
You will take care of me. I will always take care of you. I will always make you happy. I promise you, I will always, always make you feel like a man. Gucci, where are you coming from? And how is it your business where I am coming from? Why are you wasting your precious time asking me useless questions? <laughs> Wait. So you've made it a habit, right? Yesterday, you slept out. Today, you're coming back at this ungodly hour of the night? But you, why did you become this irresponsible? Irresponsible? How dare you call me irresponsible? Are you okay? Are you alright? Who abandoned her family because of her so-called beloved career? You! Who has denied her husband his conjugal right? You! Who missed her daughter's birthday because she traveled for a business meeting? You! How else can one define irresponsibility? Olivia, you are the irresponsible one. Bow the dash. Mm. Wow, woo. So because I finally started doing what I love, does that give you the right to always sleep outside and come, up, come, and come home late? I don't have time to banter webs with you. I just want to have a cold shower and rest. Really? Bow the dash. But I can't be talking to you and you are walking out on me. It does not make sense. I am still talking and you are walking out. You know what? You come back and continue this conversation because I'm not done yet. No, no, no. Better go and get your boxing gloves. All right? Better go and get your boxing gloves and wait for me. Butchie, you come dash. back and continue this conversation. This conversation is not over. Oh, rubbish. Candy. Who is Candy? Butchie! 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 Are you having issues with you? I don't know. Who is Candy? Butchie, who is Candy? How dare you search my phone? Are you okay? Are you alright? Butchie, who is Candy? And why is she sending you a new picture? By this time of the night? Well, I don't blame you. I blame myself for not locking my phone, for not changing my password. Butchie? Don't you ever go to my phone again, please. But you are asking you who is Candy, and you are telling me why, why, why do I have to touch your phone? Who is Candy? No, 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 you're not ready yet, oh. You are not ready yet because I'm not seeing your bossing gloves. No, 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 punch me. No, 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 no. Attack me. But you said who is Candy? No, no, no. But you, who me. is Candy? Who is Candy? You must tell me who is Candy. You are sending you the picture at the start of the night. Who is Candy? Candy is Candy Crush. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Babes! Yeah, baby. And this is this place. You like it? Of course I love it! It's so beautiful! Darling, this is your house. Oh yes. This is your new Stop home. Stop it! Stop it, Ray! Stop it! You know you're not good at surprises, so just stop it! Uh, hey, I'm not kidding. This is your new home. I mean, I have 
everything. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Babe? Yeah. This is my house? This is your new home. Jesus Christ! <laughs> this is so beautiful! Oh, yeah. God! Yeah. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Look at the office trees. Yeah, everything imported. Baby, everything about this house. It's sexy, it's oh, beautiful! Yeah. <laughs> mm. Thank you. It's all right. Mm. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, Thank well, you. Well, Honey, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do Come to on. deserve this? Come on. How did you even think of getting me a house, <laughs> a home? Hey. I mean, all you've done is giving me your time, attention, and love. <sighs> So this is little of what I can do for you. No, baby, you've done a lot already. This is huge. This is, this is massive. This is beautiful. Hey. I'm glad you like it. I love you. <laughs> Thank you. I love you so much. I love you with all of me. You know what? You just have to get ready. Because tonight, I am going to make it a very memorable one for you. Honestly, I can wait. I know, right? <laughs> have you seen the master bedroom? I can't wait to test that six by six and know how the rebel. You is. are a bad boy. <laughs> I can't wait to see it too, baby. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh my god! Mm -hmm. This house is sexy! I know, I know, you know, I know. I'm gonna come and come and come over and over again for you in this house. Yeah, Trust me! Yeah, I know, baby. <laughs> oh my baby, come, come. I need to go I see the inside. Uh -huh. I need to go see the room. Baby. Yeah, sure. Come on. Let's go see the room. <laughs> oh my god!
Gabriella, why haven't you gone home? I'm waiting for my dad. Ha! Ah, he's not here by this time. Why don't you go inside and sit instead of standing here? This is where I wait for my parents. Baby girl, you know how it is now. I had to sneak out from a meeting to come and pick you. Once I drop you at home now, I am returning to the meeting. Meeting? Yes. By this time, Dad, look, it's almost 6 p.m. Darling, it's scheduled for 6 p.m. It's a regional meeting, okay? They came from different states. Politicians, they do theirs midnight. <laughs> I mean, so, I wonder. enough of all that. Um, don't worry, it's not going to take time, okay? Once I'm done, I'm coming home. So, you, you're you going to drop me? Oh, yeah. Go to the office, right? Oh, yes. But before that, I will get you pizza and ice cream. All right? So, you want to bribe me like mom? Um, come on, baby. That's not bribe. I just want you to stay home with some refreshment. Okay? Come on. I miss when we were one big family. I miss when mom used to pick me up from school. I miss when when mom used to help me with my assignments. And after that, we we'll watch cartoons together. Uh -huh. I miss when we used to sit at the dining table and eat together as one big happy family. I miss when we, we play together. I miss when you and mom buy me pizza and ice cream because you love me and wanted to make me happy. Not now that you buy it as a bribe to make me happy for leaving me. Um, come on, baby girl. We love you. We love you very much. I doubt if you do so. Um, baby girl, we love you so much, okay? Just that your mom and I, we are having little misunderstanding, okay? But we'll get rid of it, all right? Please, I don't want you to ever doubt our love for you. No matter what it is, we will always love you. Okay? So please, stop crying, darling. Alright? Stop crying. Wipe away your tears. Alright? Okay, Dad. Wipe your tears, please. Okay? Stop crying. Okay, Dad. Mom and Dad will always love you. Okay? Okay, Dad. Alright, baby girl. It's fine. Oh 
yeah, you're home. So all you need to do now is freshen up and enjoy your pizza and I ice cream, all right? Sorry, excuse me, darling. Yeah. Um, I will soon be with you, all right? Oh, my. <laughs> Oh my God, I know, I know. Uh, oh my God, I mean, me too, I can't wait, all right? I, yeah. Oh, I know, me too. Um, I, 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 I am coming, all right? Stop it! <clears throat> I will soon be with you, okay? Come on, stop it! Oh. oh, yes, yes, I will soon be with you. Yeah. Um, they are calling you at the office, right? Oh, yes, darling. Um, I have to go. Okay? Okay, Dad, bye. Um, baby girl, whatever you want, the cook will attend to you, okay? okay so, Dad. freshen up, enjoy your pizza and ice cream. See you when I come back. Scared of what? That you will reconcile with your wife and then throw me out. You're gonna discard me like a used tissue paper. I am falling deeply in love with you. And if you break my heart, I am going to kill myself. I love you. What I feel for you now is exactly what I felt for my... Um, that's all in the past now. It is you I love. Can I trust you? Of course, baby, you can. Please, do not disappoint me. I can't imagine a life without you. I can't live without you. I have put all my eggs in your basket. Please do not leave me. You don't have to be scared, all right? All your eggs are safe with me. I am making plans to divorce my wife. And when I do, then we be together forever. Then I can't wait. I 
can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you so much. I love you with everything in me. Oh. I want a divorce. Now you think I'll beg you? <laughs> News flash. I won't bother begging you. If it is a divorce that you want, then a divorce you will get. I know you wouldn't beg. But if you had begged me, it would have been a total waste of your precious time because I've made up my mind and that's final. And who is asking you to change your mind? I'm not even ready to be with a man who doesn't encourage me or supports my dream. Your boss supports and encourages you, right? And what does that mean? You're asking me? Yes, because everything is all about your boss. My boss this, my boss that. I know he's sleeping with you. Yes. How dare you, Gucci? How dare you accuse me of infidelity? How could you even think of such a thing? Why won't I think of such a thing? Oh. If you both want a place to continue this argument, can you find somewhere else? And not in this hospital. And obviously not in the presence of this little girl. I would appreciate if the both of you go outside and remain there. Please. Um, My nurses can take care of her. Um, doctor, you can go while I stay. Madam, please, can the both of you go outside? I just hope you are going let to that prostitute. To your boss. Because that house will not contain the both of us. Let, 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 that house will not contain let, the both of us. Let, let, let me take it to your boss. No, Gabriela is now stable. We'll soon discharge him. Thank you so much, Doctor. Thank you. Thank you, Doctor. Thank God she's now back to normal. But I hope she doesn't have a relapse. Um, that will be left for the both of you. Gabriela is special. And she's very emotional. If this this news of the divorce could cost us. Then imagine what would happen when the both of you eventually get divorced. My advice, please, for the sake of your daughter, you both should go home and try and reconcile your differences. Ah, uh, work, of course. Uh, you know your mom, I know she has a lot to submit to her boss. She wasted a lot of time with us at the hospital, so I believe she's going to work. Uh, uh, my love, don't mind your daddy. I am not going anywhere, okay? I want to go and make you your favorite meal. Yay, mom, I can't wait. <laughs> Mom, I really missed your food. Oh, I know. <laughs> mm. All right, let me quickly go and make it, okay? Okay. All right. Thank you. <clears throat> yes, thank you.
Let's just walk in by the water. Okay. Uh -huh. Gabriela, food is ready. Okay, mom. Daddy, come and eat. Daddy's not hungry, okay? Are you sure? Because I know that you have not eaten anything since we've been together from the hospital. Oh, yeah, that's true, but I'm not hungry now. And besides, if I'm hungry, I'll go out and eat. Gabriela, you need to come and eat before your food gets cold. You know you don't like it when it's cold. Mom, I know, but I'm just trying to get Daddy to join us. Daddy said he's not hungry, so come and eat your food. No. I can't eat without dad. If dad is not eating, then I'm not eating. Gabriela, I only need to eat for both of us. But why, mom? You know we are three in this house. Why didn't you make his own? In that case, I'll wait till you make his own before I eat. Gabriela. <laughs> Hello, Candy. Hey, babe. What happened to be picking my calls? Um, my daughter has been in the hospital, so we just came home now. And how is she feeling now? Ah, she's feeling fine by God's grace, though we're still observing her. And your wife is there, right? Yeah, she is. Are you still coming out to see me? I miss you. Ah, I miss you so much, my candy. You know, but I'll try to see you. I will. Please do. My candy misses you a lot. Mmm! Ah, stop it. Oh, stop it. Stop killing me. I miss you too, baby. You know that, right? Don't worry, I will see you soon, okay? Come, ah, 
I love you so much, baby. I love you too, baby. Okay, see you soon, all right? Mm. Bye. <laughs> I am sorry, Buchi. I have realized it's all my fault. I can't afford to have a divorce at this time. You know I am from a broken home. And I know how traumatizing it was for me then. I can't afford to see Gabriela go through the same pain. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. Olivia, you hurt me so much. You abandoned Gabriel and I. I know. I promise to turn a new leaf. I promise to give you all the love and attention that you require. I know it's going to be hard balancing both, but I will try. I already spoke to a counselor that will help me. I love you too much to lose you. Please. I love you too. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Hello, Kande. You didn't come to see me as you promised the other day. I was busy. I'm sorry about that. So busy that you can't call or even return my own calls. I'm so sorry I got busy so I couldn't get to you. Baby, what's wrong with you? What's going on? I mean, you are never busy to see your candy crush. What's going on? That won't be possible right now, okay? I got some things that require my attention, so I'll talk to you. Does this other things include your wife? I'll call you when I'm less busy, Kande, all right? Baby, are you there? I am here. I'll call you when I'm less busy. No, babe. Just hold on. You can't see me now. I'm very busy. There is something very important I need to tell you. Um, never mind, never mind. What do you want to tell me? Baby, I missed my period. You missed your period? How? I don't understand. You better go get it where you lost it, though. Come on, but you don't play dumb with me. You know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm pregnant. I will call you when I'm less busy, Candy. So what are we going to do about it? You need to send your wife home. You need to divorce her and marry me. I, I can't share my mom with another woman. I'll call you when I'm less busy. I don't want you to call me. I want to see you now. I will call you when I'm less busy. Hello, 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 Buchi. Ah. What's all this? You're pregnant. How? I don't understand. Mm. I hope you're not thinking of dumping me.
because it won't be funny. So, um, let's do one of my childhood games. Which one? Think, uh, think. Do you know how to play? Yes, yes, yes. Alright, yes, yes. let's go. Think, uh, think, uh, think. No, like this. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm sure you are going to be the one to lose. <laughs> you lose, you lose, you lose. Oh my Daddy, welcome. <laughs> How are you? Fine. How was your day? Ah, fine, fine. Then you were playing a game. Come on, join us. Mm. Oh, um, maybe some other time, okay? I'm so tired, I need to rest. Are you okay? Yes. Okay. I am fine. Uh, Just tired. Okay. Okay then. Let's go. Let's go. You, you won. No, no, no. no. I won. No, I won. Mm. You lose. I won. Let's go again. Well, we stopped at three, right? Let's go again. Ah, sweet. <laughs> it's supposed to be three. <laughs> Honey. Is it showing? Well, it's not showing. Okay, let me turn to the right. Mm, turn it to the left. To the left? Just check it very well. It should be showing by now. I'm yeah, not tired. No, what are you saying? Oh, honey, you didn't tell me you'd be telling me. Mike, I have been begging you to buy Moplex HDTV decoder, but you refused. Moplex HDTV decoder is the most affordable and reliable decoder in the market right now. With just 10,000 Naira, you can buy it. Do you know you can also apply for Moplex HDTV decoder lease option with monthly payment of 1,000 Naira for 12 months. You can watch EPL, La Liga, Serie A and all the league matches. You can watch the latest Nollywood, Bollywood and Hollywood movies including the telenovelas and the K-drama. Mooplex for us by yours. Baby, are you okay? You look worried. Um, I'm fine, baby. You know, I just need to clear my head. Are you sure? Baby, you know you can always talk to me about anything that is bothering you. And I might be of help. Uh -huh. I mean, sweetheart, I'm fine, all right? I'll be okay, I'll be okay. Just that I have a lot of things, you know. I need to cool my head off, okay? You know how it is now, you know. <laughs> Men and office, wahala and stuff. Yeah, I'll be fine, don't worry. I'll be okay. It's a general thing. I'll be all right. <laughs> Dad, what's wrong? Are you okay? I am fine. I just don't have an appetite. Oh. I'm so sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Oh. 
keep you. What's wrong? You're not sleepy. I am sorry, Olivia. You're sorry? What for? You're getting me scared. What's the problem? I have offended you. You have been accusing me of infidelity. I have never denied or confirmed it. But the truth is, I am having an affair with Candy. One of those nights, we had issues. I left the house to a bar to cool my head off. There I met her. We got talking. From the bar, we went to her house. And we had sex. Which we continued. <laughs> but I was doing that because I wasn't happy the way our marriage was going. And you seemed not to care about it. It was a mistake. I, I feel so horrible right now. I feel so bad. I feel so dirty. Please forgive me, my love. Please forgive me. Beg you. I the horses. She told me she's pregnant. Please, it was a mistake. Forgive me, my love, I beg you. Please. Olivia. Please, baby, say something. I knew you were involved in a extramarital affair, but I didn't just place it. The pictures, I didn't just... Because oh. ever since we got married, I never doubted your fidelity. Oh! oh. It was just a mistake. Just a mistake. Please forgive me, my love. Forgive me. It was a mistake, I beg you. Please. Please, baby. God. I will. I will. Please. Please. Please, baby. 
I beg you. Forgive me. Sorry to <laughs> this is partly my fault. How can I crucify you for a crime I pushed you to commit? <laughs> I'm sorry. <sighs> there is no justification for what I've done. <laughs> There is no justification for what I have done. I allowed my emotions to cloud my sense of reasoning. Please. It's okay. Please forgive me, baby. It's okay, baby. I'm so sorry. Please. But please. Promise me it will never happen again. I will never. <laughs> I will never cheat on you. I will never, ever try it again. <laughs> okay. Swell my life. <laughs> What am I going to do about the pregnancy?
My love. What's wrong? Babe, why are you acting so cold towards me? missed you and I know you miss me too I just want you to have a taste of my candy just one more time We need to talk. We can't continue this anymore. I have reconciled with my wife. I love my family so much that I can't leave them because of one night stand we had. One night stand? Yes. But you called what we share a one night stand? Whatever we had was a mistake. What? I am sorry if I led you on. But I can't leave a woman I have been with for 13 years. And marry you I just met a few months ago. Why? Why? Why are you saying this to me? Why are you killing me with these words? You told me you love me. You promised to divorce your wife and, and get married to me, Buchi. These were your words. I made that promise out of anger. <laughs> I am so sorry for deceiving you. Whatever you thought we had is over. Candy, I bought you this house. And if truly you're pregnant for me, I am going to continue taking care of you and my baby. I will make sure you guys don't lack. But I want you to get one thing straight. I am not going to marry you. And I will never divorce my wife for any reason.
Wahrheit zu mir. You made me believe you loved me. You made me cut all ties with my suitors simply because because you promised to divorce your wife and get married to me. You treated me like a fool. I'm sorry. We can't be together. I came here because I want to take you to the hospital to confirm if truly you're pregnant with me. I'll be in my car waiting for you. Please be fast with whatever you're about to do. I've already booked an appointment with the doctor. You are not leaving this house. Candy. Candy. This is so dangerous. Oh, oh shut up! I will make sure you remain under the roof with me. Uchi, I am not letting you leave. Candy. Candy, don't hit yourself so hard. It hasn't gotten to this. Alright? Candy. You are so wicked. Candy, just. Just shut up. Candy. Shut Candy. your mouth! Just, just. Just look at you. In your mind, I am now a piece of trash. No. Just understand me, alright? I have been used and dumped no, by you, right? No, no Candy. I, 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 just understand. Just shut up! Candy, Candy, Candy. Now, sit your ass on that couch. Alright. Sit! Alright. It's alright, I'm seated. Alright, Candy. What did I do to you? Candy, just. Why did you do Candy, will you just me? give me a second to talk to you to explain? There is no, no. time for that. Oh my god. What, what have I done? What have I done? <laughs> This feeling that your dad is in trouble. My dad? Have you tried reaching him? I have called his number over and over again. He's not picking. Uh, like, call him again. Like him. Oh, would you please pick up? Oh. Has he picked? Uh. 
Oh. I don't know. Oh. Would you please speak up? Would you please don't speak? Speak <laughs> up. I don't know. Come on, Ty. I'll try again. So, um, Mr. Uchi, thank God that the court didn't affect any of your organs. Mm. By the grace of God, you'll be fine. Amen. 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 Hmm. I am glad that the both of you are happy together. Unlike the last time you both were here, it was World War Three. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Mr. Bucci and um, Mrs. Bucci. Excuse me. Uh, thank you, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. <laughs> you know, I called your number several times. It was not responding. I was so scared and worried. I had to track your phone to that location where I found you unconscious. Thank you so much, darling. I truly appreciate it. I would have been dead by now. Can you imagine that girl tried to kill me when I told her I was no longer interested? Um, I have already reported the case to the police. I'm sure by now they will be looking for her. I pray they catch her. That girl is evil. Baby, do you know she lied about the pregnancy? <laughs> <sighs> I can't imagine I cheated on you, honestly. It hurts me so much. <laughs> what was I thinking? It's fine, baby. It's fine. We just need to be thanking God that you are well and alive. That is all that matters to me right now. Thank you so much, darling. You are the best. Thank you. I will never, ever cheat on you again. And I promise to be a submissive wife. I promise. Thank you so much. It's fine. Daddy, how are you? How are you feeling? Baby girl, look funny. How are you? Thank you. Come, baby. Daddy will be fine, okay? Okay, mom. Jeff. Yeah.